So there's two reasons why I set up Circular almost 20 years ago. One was this. My wife and I desperately wanted to live a short walk from the sea, so we went for it. Secondly, it was actually my granddad. The reason for my granddad is that designing for Dyson back then, 20 years ago, I could already tell that from an industry perspective, we were sleepwalking into a, a colossal waste mountain. We were designing products with no attempt to think about what would happen to them at the end. Culturally in society, we were doing the same. We'd got used to that throwaway culture as my granddad's generation was still living that that culture where nothing was ever wasted and at the same time we were running out of natural resources so it just seemed ludicrous in my eyes that we should be working to that way there had to be a better way so this wasteful economy i talk about we term a linear or a river economy where we take resources out of the ground we make things and then they waste it's a linear it flows out into the end and ironically into the ocean um, we're trying to approach a new system called a circular model or a lake model where we try and capture all that resource and value materials in that lake and just perpetually reuse it time and time again. Some of the benefits of a lake economy is we start to reduce that waste mountain, we start to reduce carbon emissions, we start to reduce costs because it's fundamentally cheaper to reuse what we've already got. To me it's a complete win-win and the best part of all is it's absolutely doable. We've been doing it 20 years so let's crack on.